Bible lets us know that the fire of the Lord fell down in the midst of this situation. 38 verse says, and consumed the burnt sacrifice and the wood and the stones. That's some bad fire, y'all. And the dust. And it lit up the water that was in the trench. The scientists have to sit down now. Hallelujah. Now that all the people saw, saw it and fell on their faces, and they said, the Lord, He is God. The Lord, He is God. Now if it had been some of us, in this scenario, I would have probably, and me, even me myself, I would have probably called it a day. <laughs> it said, God has done some great things in our midst. And he has proven himself, and he has shown himself strong. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But Elijah said, the day is not finished yet. Amen. We're getting ready to do something that will top the last thing that God did. Look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor your next blessing is going to top the last one. Hallelujah. And just in case you're sitting here tonight and you're saying, well, God has been good. He's been showing up good. And, and uh, he really can't talk what he did for me last week. Well, I got some good news for you. Amen. God's getting ready. Amen. To do exceedingly. Abundantly. Above. All that you can ask of faith. Just when you thought God was finished, God said, I'm getting ready to do something even the more greater in your life. Just when you thought God was finished with your life and that there is nothing else that he can improve upon and that there is nothing else that God can do for you, God will show up and show out and talk the last Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bible says in the 41st verse that Elijah said to Ahab, go up, eat and drink. But there is the sound of abundance of rain. This text messed me up. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. How do you hear something? before you see the manifestation. <laughs> How do you have more ability in the sensory realm of hearing rather in the optical realm of seeing? And then I'm reminded of the scripture that we walk by faith. And not by sight. <laughs> Hallelujah. We must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Thank you, Lord. I'm getting to know the character of Elijah with the text because I find out that this man was, yes, he's a man, but he's also a man full of faith. Hallelujah. This man could, he had keen hearing in the sense of the scriptures when it says that faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of the Lord. So that tells me that faith and hearing is more important than see. I oh, know. I'm going to lose some of y'all because you said, well, Bishop, seeing is believing. When I see it, that's when I will believe it. 
But let me explain to you that this next miracle is even a greater miracle because of the level of faith that it's going to take to see the manifestation within it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. The Bible says, so Ahab went up to eat and drink. And Elijah went up to the top of Carmel. Same mountain they had the contest of. Then he bowed down on the ground. He was a man of prayer, this lets me know. And he put his face between his knees. Said to his servants, Go up now and look toward the sea. Hallelujah. You don't mind, I just want to talk about both of these fellows' character for a minute. We got Elijah that said, I hear the sound of abundance of rain. And then you have him saying to the servant, go up and look toward the sea. Hold on a minute. I'm rating the thing. One minute, and they want to see something. The next minute, sounds just like us, don't it? Hallelujah. So how can you operate in faith as a prophet and declare that I hear the sound of abundance of rain, and then a few sentences later saying, "Go look toward the sea." Hallelujah. I'm trying to find out that these are two men operating just like a man. Amen. Got any ladies in the house? Amen. How many know even though we have faith as our goal and as our example, we still got to deal with the flesh that we're in. And how many know there's a big difference between men and women in the area of faith? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Women will pray while they're expecting. <laughs> and they will pray until they get manifestation. Yeah. But a man. <laughs> We'll have to see things because they're analytical. Now, 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 let me have somebody's marriage here. Because the woman has been complaining that he won't talk. <laughs> And it's his makeup not to talk. <laughs> because a man will talk when he gets manifestation. <laughs> a woman will talk all the way. The woman that had the issue of blood received her manifestation. But all the while that she was pressing into Jesus, she kept saying, Come on, women, help me out. She kept 